Hey guys, Zach here from Hot Wheeling with Zach and Jeff. Um, today I'll be showing you some that we got opened. Um, some of them we will be opening. I had another video up on the phone, but it was sideways and it wouldn't look good on the on your computer screen or phone, whatever you use. So I'm just going to do it on a good camera. Um, the lighting's better with this camera too. But anyways, we got this match, uh, Matchbox Speed Shop car. Um, we got it used. It would be a good custom if somebody wants to buy it from us. Um, we'll sell it cheap. Just let us know if you want it. Um, it's an older older model. It's pretty nice. Um, the metal. wheels, the wheels in the front are kind of loose. It's all metal, but it's nice. So, if somebody wants it in the comment section, let us know, and we'll try and get a hold of you. Um, next is um, a Dodge Charger uh, sheriff car we got. It's pretty nice. Also, I'm going to try and have our Facebook page uh, for our Hot Wheels in the description. Um, you guys can check that out. We'll be putting pictures and stuff up on that. I think Dad will be in charge of that. I'll help him out though. We also got this um, Backyardigans Matchbox. Um, it's, it's pretty nice. I don't like like the cartoon type things on there. I don't like that. And if this was an older model, they would have the back bed open. But this is a newer model, and they don't do that anymore. So this is uh, all metal, though. Actually, no, the bottom's plastic. Yeah. But here's that. Um, and then these we started to crack on the old video we were gonna upload. We never did upload it. But this is the uh, F-150 from the truck series we got. How's how's the lighting on that? Well, it's pretty good. Um, we, it has chrome interior, uh, yellow windows, uh, yellow pinstripes. It's pretty nice. The only thing I don't like about these are the tires stick out some. So, I don't know if you can tell that or not, but yeah, that kind of moves. But uh, it's nice. Yeah, it would look really nice with real riders. Yeah, it would actually look pretty good with real riders. Or if they like beefed it up a little bit and put some off-road tires mm-hmm yeah Something that, like goes that would work too yeah um, next is um, the Firebird I actually like this one a lot it's pretty nice I like the uh, eagle on the front or, yeah that's an eagle I think it's a Phoenix or a Phoenix whatever it is I don't know <laughs> uh, it's got the t-top or somebody tell me some of you guys from the 70s is that a Thunderbird that's a Firebird no I'm talking about the bird the flames. Somebody tell us. I can't remember. Yeah, I like the T-top on it though. That's pretty nice. Alright, um, next one is the Mustang. Uh, what case is this from? That's F case. F, okay. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Um, the uh, Spoil. spoiler down here at the bottom, it moves up and down, so you can move it down. It's pretty nice. The only thing I do not like about this is the back. It looks like somebody crashed into it, and that's like something that they put on there temporarily or something. It looks, it looks bad. I don't like that. But the rest of it's pretty nice. I actually like it. So. Um, next is the, what is this? Is that a Bronco? Bronco. I think it's the Bronco. Let me look. Four by four. No, it's a Blazer. That's what I said. Blazer. <laughs> That's the, it's the blazer uh, from the rescue series. Is that what mm -hmm. it is? Yeah. These tires would look good on that F-150. Yes, they would. Make that yellow and stuff. I actually white. think they would they would look better on the F-150 rather than on this one. If this one had, I don't know, if it was lower and had some five spokes or something. Next is the Coco Camaro. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Pretty nice too. I like the pink stripes. Love stuff. the Camaros. Our, the paint on the top is coming off. But, uh, it don't matter. Next is the Chevelle. That's one of the KD cars. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is one of the KD cars. But um, this one here would be good if it was all metal, but it's not. So, but it's pretty nice. I like it. I actually found this one, uh, everybody, last week when I went into Kmart. That one was still, uh, along with several other K-Day cars, was still in a bin uh, right there on top, so I grabbed a few of them. This is the Ford Fiesta. 
Um, since this is white, it's it's pretty bright on the on the camera. So you want to go ahead and start cracking those uh, if you want to. I'll just go ahead and start showing. Them. We got some over here. We're cracking. Matchbox. I'll just show. We also got this Matchbox police car. Sweet looking matchbox. What's it say on the side there? Um, is that beach patrol or something? No, official vehicle beach, yeah, beach patrol. All right. Looks like something from Baywatch. And the only the thing I would, yeah, the only thing I wish they would do is make the headlights and backlights. All right, go ahead and crack that one. Man. All right, here comes the Mustang Mach One. Love these muscle cars. There you go. Sweet looking. Looks like the windshield's pushed in on ours. Yeah, it's not, but that's the way they designed it. Go ahead and crack that one, Dad. Yeah. All right, okay. All right here's the teed off two. I'm sure everybody's seen this one. 2015. All right, I'm having trouble. There we go. All right, next. Custom Ford Bronco. Everybody's seen this beauty. All right, right over. We got this bad boy coming. The plastic go too bad. That's rolling on us. The two boy level. Alright, go ahead and crack that one, man. Yeah. And this is the old bump around uh, from 2015, 14 actually. The old bump around bumper car that you see at state fairs and carnivals and things. For those of you that like those kind of castings, uh, it's not one of my favorites. I wonder how this would do on the track. It looks, it doesn't weigh hardly anything. Yeah, it probably wouldn't go very far. All right, now we have an El Camino. El Camino, come on out. There we go. Nice looking El Camino. Very sweet look. From 2015. Here's the 43 Willis from the Jeep series and Matchbox uh, from last year. Yeah, we've got four of those. So. Yeah, we have several of these, so I guess you could say we hold it up on them a little bit. Didn't mean to. Sometimes I forget what I buy. Y'all know how that is. That's the last one. This one... This one kind of rocks back and forth like it has some kind of suspension mount. It doesn't. It's pretty cool. Just like a Jeep. We also got this um, poster here from Kmart. My dad went and got this. It was in the bin on top. You got this like two two weeks after K Day. Uh, well, whatever last week was about three weeks. Yeah, about yeah. two weeks. About two weeks. He got this two weeks after K Day, and no one still had. They it. still had a lot of the main lines in the in the bin. But um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share our videos. I'll have the Facebook um, link in the description below. Um, check it out. Uh, we don't have anything on it just yet, but we will start adding stuff on there. Um, check out um, Tex, uh, Big Cat 9966, and Jimmy Mitchell 24-7. Is there anyone else you're missing? Yeah, you forgot to say his last name, Tex Tanner. Oh yeah, Tex Tanner. <laughs> uh, uh, there's a lot of guys, Frank's Kids, Frankie Boy, um, Jason Fry, everybody knows. Um, so many, um, actually, PJ. All right, um, we'll see you guys in the next video.